What's up guys, because I can gaming, and today we have a solo car duplication glitch. If you're familiar with the Deluxo car duplication glitch, it has been switched around a little bit to dupe retro LG customs what sell for a lot more money. So here we go, I'm gonna show you how to do it. You wanna re you wanna free LG in any garage that's not your nightclub or your facility, what you see right here. Before I continue, founders will be in the description. Make sure you check them out and shout out to the notification gang. So what we're going to do is we have our one allergy here. You're going to want your Deluxo in a different garage and you're going to want your nightclub level three or four or two. I had three that worked on three. You want a free retro allergy in spot two. You want your garage full and you want your retro allergy custom in spot one. I'll show you that later on. So here you see I pulled out my free retro allergy or sorry, my free allergy out of one garage. I'm just gonna drive up, I'm gonna steal another car, and I'm gonna drive as far away from it as possible. You don't need to go too crazy, but you're just gonna drive away from it. So after I pick myself off the ground, I'm gonna jump into this Firebird, and away we go. So like I said, this is super easy, no timing involved, and it's gonna give you a clean dupe. So you don't need the custom plates or anything like that. You do need a CEO with a, with a mod shop, or you need your MOC with your vehicle storage. That's how we're going to save these. So as you see here, I'm just driving away from my allergy that I pulled out, which is my free one. Once I get far enough away, I'm going to call in my Deluxo. So you want that in a different garage, which wasn't the garage you were just in, by the way. Now, if you guys are familiar with the Deluxo glitch, a lot of the steps are the same because you are duplicating your Deluxo, but then we're going to end up merging it to your Retro Elegy. So you see I'm far enough away from my car, I'm just going to call in my Deluxo. Again, you don't want it in the same garage. Other than that, guys, this is super easy. If it works for you, leave a comment. Say it worked as of today's date. Hopefully we have this all weekend long. I don't think Rockstar is going to patch it until at least Monday or Tuesday. So it should give you guys a chance to stock up on your retro allergies because Tuesday is supposed to be the mark to oppressor guys get those cars sold follow the sell rules biggest thing links in the description about sell rules make sure you don't get duped detected I'm in my deluxo I'm gonna fly to the airport I'm gonna zoom in and show you where I'm going now if your first time doing this glitch it's easy to find I'm gonna show you again if you don't have a retro allergy and you have a deluxo that you want to try duping you can dupe the deluxo with the same steps I'll tell you when to stop and you can sell them. I think they sell for like two hundred fifty, three hundred thousand dollars. So it's a little bit of money. It's not, you know, almost a million dollars with a retro allergy, but at least it's something for you guys to get some spare money with. So you see, I am driving to the airport, right where I got marked out, and I'm going to go to the garage door. Again, if you guys pay attention, I will show you exactly where I'm going. I didn't hit it the first try because I'm a little rusty flying my Deluxo but I hit it my second try and all I did was I went too far up and didn't get into the wall breach. So we're gonna wall breach with the Deluxo. This is one of the few ones that are still working without dying. So I land, there's the garage. I wanna slowly go up till I hit the top. So here we go. Like I said, the first time I kinda messed up, I went too high. That happens, just back up, no big deal. Turn back around and try it one more time. I get it this time pretty easily, like I said, it's kind of an easy glitch to hit. Here we go, up, up, and away. So you want to go right about there, you get in, and you just want to go down. You don't want to pop back up, you don't want to drive around. You're going to go to the airport, which you see right there. So you're going to go to the airport. I'm going to mark out and show you what you got to do. Again, this is super easy, I can't say this enough. So you're going to the airport, I'm going to mark out and show you exactly where you're going. You're going to go straight, when you do this, make sure your guys are pretty well dead even to where I'm going to mark out. That way you'll hit it every time. I haven't had an issue. I hit it my first time doing this video, and I hit it a couple times after that, one after another. So it's easy if you want to rinse and repeat. Just make sure you follow the all rules. It's the biggest thing. I don't want to see you get duped detected. So here we go. You want to go, not there. You want to go down below that. I'm going to show you in a second. I had a little brain fart. I was trying to talk and do this at the same time it didn't really work for me so right there's where you want to be and you want to be about even in there so you don't want to be too close to either side once you get there and I'm showing you again right here see super easy to see once you get there you're gonna drop your wheels 
So I'm going to show you, you can look on the map as you see that I'm getting closer. You don't want to be too close to the white line or too close to the grass. You want to be dead center of that little square. As you see, I'm coming up now. And once you get in there, like I said, if you're not dead center, just back up, go sideways. Whatever the case may be, you can, you can maneuver your car pretty easily. So there I am on the white line. I'm going, I'm about dead center, right about there. So once you're dead center, you're just going to put your wheels in. You're going to fall to the ground. You should stay in this little black square. As you see, I landed there. I'm just going to sit there. When my mini map and screen go black, I'm going to hit and hold the gas. So all you have to do is about to go black. Boom, went black. I hit and held the gas. I'm going to spawn up top. Once I get up top, my plate has changed, as you see. So now I'm in a duplicate car. So that this is the spot if you had the Deluxo and this is all you had, you'd go save this and call it a day. And then you could sell your saved dupe once you change something. If you have the Retro Allergy like I do and you want to dupe that, you're going to go to your nightclub now. So I marked off my nightclub and I'm going to head over there. Now you remember I said that you needed a Retro Allergy and a Free Allergy in your nightclub. So in spot one of my level three of my nightclub, I have my Retro Allergy Custom. And in spot two, three, four, all the way up to ten, I have my free allergies. Because I want to overwrite a car. So you got to make sure your garage is full. I will show you what I mean when I get up here. So as I go up here, make sure you guys check out the links in the description. We have the no top glitch is still working or the overcoat glitch. The speed glitches are still working, surprisingly. I'm surprised Rockstar haven't fixed that. We have the unlimited canning glitch with no cooldown. That is never going to get patched. Um, there's some nice working glitches. Links are in the description. I try to keep up on it. If I miss it, leave a comment on that video and I will write patch in the description. That way I don't waste no one's time and everyone knows what glitches are working or not. So here you go. I'm going up to my nightclub. And before you go into your nightclub, you're going to call in another free allergy. So I'm going to get up by the door. I don't want to go in just yet. And you're going to call in. Now I told you I'm doing this on level 3. So I want to call my car that I'm going to order on level 3 and I want to put it in the second spot. So here we go, going to the free cars, free allergy, going to level 3 and I put it in the second spot. When you see it will show you that the first spot is my retro allergy and my second spot is an allergy RH8. So I'm going to replace it, I'm going to back out real quickly and I'm going to drive my Deluxo in there. Now I want to put this in the spot of the car I just ordered. So I'm going to go to level 3 and I'm going to go to spot 2 which right now is an empty spot because the new car hasn't really, hasn't arrived yet. So once I get in, it's going to ask me where I want to put it. Boom, you see the empty spot. That's where I'm putting it. I'm going to run to the blue circle nice and fast. And I'm going to take my Retro Allergy Custom in spot 1 and put it in spot 2. As soon as I do that, it dupes. Watch this. Boom, there we go. So now we have a dupe. But it's not saved yet. So both will still share the same plate. So, if you realize, the one in spot 1 is my duplicate, and it says because I can, for because I can gaming. So I'm going to jump in it, I'm going to pull it outside. As soon as I pull it outside, it's going to merge the, the plate off of the retro, or the free allergy I pulled out originally. Here we go. Plate's going to change. I show you the plate changes. Boom. Just like that, it's changed. Now, this is where you can go to your CEO office with a mod shop, change a plate color or something small, which will force a save on it, and it's yours to keep. Or you can do what I just did. I'm calling in my MOC. Once I go to my MOC, I'm going to drive it in the back, and it's automatically going to save as well, and then your glitch is done. Before I get off, if you guys want to rinse and repeat, just make sure you have more free allergies and other garages, and you want to make sure, well, that's pretty well it to be honest, you call it out and start fresh over again. Like I said, if this video worked for you guys, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you save it in your MOC or mod shop before you go anywhere else with it. I save it and I put it back in my garage or my nightclub. Other than that, guys, thanks a lot. Let me know what you think. Make sure you hit that big fat red subscribe button. And until next time.